Yo, what's good, man? It's your boy DT3, man, and I'm big edge with another video, man. New media notification game. God squad. That's what it is, man. Look, I told your punk ass that I'm going to roast your whole ass. I've been telling y'all motherfuckers, I've been quiet. I've been quiet. Ain't made no videos about you. Nah, nah. Been sitting here in my own zone, my own lane, trying to be cool. Not trying to make videos every time you say and do some dumb shit. Trying to be cool. But then I've checked my timeline on um, Instagram, and then I see you say some bitch ass, hoe ass shit about them fuck boys on the LDBC all of a sudden. Them, them ain't nothing but fanboys. Them ain't nothing but niggas that's chasing the check. That's all they doing. They chasing the check. They don't care about the integrity of the sport of boxing. They don't care about super fights happening in the sport of boxing. All they care about is who paying. And you PBC bitch ass niggas, y'all motherfuckers is paying them hoe ass niggas on the LDBC to, to uh, push the narrative that they push. That's why them niggas come all together and push the same narrative. Because none of them niggas is speaking different shit. They all saying the same doctrine. They fucking robots. They doing whatever for the dollar. Fuck the integrity, fuck the honor, fuck the prestige of the sport of boxing, fuck all that. We gonna tarnish the sport by any means necessary. That's what you LDBC niggas is doing, and that's what you doing, Deontay Wilder, with all these punk ass excuses that you keep pushing, that you keep constantly trying to push over and over and over and over again, and bruh, it's all bullshit. You got your ass whooped, you can't take a loss, your bitch ass fan base in the LDBC niggas, y'all can't accept the fact that he got his ass whooped by some dude over there from the other side of the motherfucking street, y'all can't take that L. Hell, it's been a whole motherfucking year damn near since that ass whooping happening and y'all still talking about it. Y'all still ain't let it go. Punk bitches. Can't let shit go. Punk bitches. Been sitting here cool not saying nothing. Y'all just constantly saying fuck shit. Keep saying fuck shit. Keep saying fuck shit. Man, it's only so long I'm finna be quiet off this little fuck shit you whole ass niggas is doing. Because I see how y'all quick to come together on some fuck shit. Y'all good at sucking ass. Y'all don't kiss ass. Y'all suck ass. Y'all sucking all the shit crumbs out of Wilder's ass. It's ridiculous. And Wilder is the biggest fucking six foot seven shit stain in all the sports. Fuck boxing. He's the biggest shit stain in all sports. Mark Brennan just came forward and said he ain't fought nobody. Everybody that Wilder fought, I could beat them motherfuckers. What that tell you? What that tell you? Mark Breland said, Wilder don't jump rope. He don't hit the bag. So when we watching you, Wilder hit the bag on the boxing voice with Nesto, you fretting. You fretting. You fretting for the camera. You fretting for the folk. You fretting for Nesto. And Nesto bitch ass ain't no motherfucking better because his whole ass know you don't do that shit every day too and he's still filming that shit like you. That's what you really about when you ain't about that life. You don't spar motherfuckers that's really better than you. You don't really put in no real work in boxing. You don't do shit. Nothing. Nothing. The person that you constantly backing up the person that you should be on their ass about based on your accusation against Tyson Fury, Wilder, Jay Diaz. Who was back there watching Tyson Fury wrap his hands? You bitch ass niggas in the LDBC. Who the fuck was backstage watching Tyson Fury wrap his fucking hands? Was not Mark Breland. Jay motherfucking Diaz. He was back there. He's filmed back there watching him both times they fought. Jay Diaz. But yet and still, Mark Breland gets the blame for the at the accusations against Tyson Fury. He's it's Mark Breland's fault that Tyson Fury allegedly had egg weights in his in his gloves. Even though Jay Diaz was back there to watch him wrap his hands, put his hands in the gloves, all the shit. He's back there for all that. But that's Mark Breland fault though. Mark Breland got fired for stopping the fight because he didn't want to see Wilder get hurt. 
But Jay Diaz is the one that keep his job because he was the one that, was, but he was the one that was back there watching Fury get his hands wrapped. So if for whatever reason, if Fury was to actually have cheated, it ain't Mark Breland's fault. It's Jay fucking Diaz's fault. But yet and still, Jay Diaz still got a motherfucking job with Deontay Wilder. And you bitch ass niggas ain't saying shit about that. Y'all constantly pushing this narrative about Fury cheated. Well, where the fuck is the doctor's note when the bitch ass nigga went to the hospital right after the Fury fight? Because the nigga went to the hospital, ESPN reports. Stephen A. Smith, an avid Deontay Wilder fan, reported that Deontay the Bronze Bomb Wilder did go to the hospital immediately after the Tyson Fury fight and uh, arrested Turret to, uh, I didn't hear of any uh, 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 significant uh, life-threatening damage to the brain after that. I didn't hear that shit till uh, uh, maybe, what, a month later? And I think um, if it was something of the magnitude of the accusations that have been put on Tyson Fury, I think the doctors would have said something that night. I don't think it would have took a week, two weeks, or a month for all these accusations to supposedly come up out of thin fucking air. So all this bullshit y'all doing with Wilder talking about we got to keep this real talk going. Wilder, shut your whole ass up. Shut your ass up. Because you lying, you bullshitting, you on some bitch shit. The motherfuckers that you posted on your bitch ass page, they on some bitch shit. And I've been quiet. Been quiet. Been cool, calm, collective. Trying to just keep my foot off your bitch ass neck. But nah, you want to keep this whole ass shit going on in boxing? You want to keep trying to push that bitch ass narrative in boxing? Not while I'm breathing. Not while I'm on motherfucking YouTube. Nah, yeah, that shit cease. So all you new niggas that want to try to pop up in the LDBC because them niggas get numbers. They don't care about integrity, honor. They just care about, well, I got these, I got numbers. I, I get views. I get views. Y'all niggas will sell your soul for a view. For a view. Bitch ass niggas Sell your soul for a view If I wanted views I just talk about your hoe ass niggas all day long 5,000, 10,000, 20,000 Easy work But you know what I felt like I had better shit to do But now You hoe ass niggas want to push this narrative And keep pushing this narrative My foot will be permanently implanted Not on Not near Not close to it will be permanently implanted in your fucking neck because all this bullshit y'all pushing in the sport of boxing all this narrative bitch ass pushing y'all doing it's finna stop because now i'm putting my foot in all you hoe ass niggas necks and i'm gonna call all you hoe ass niggas by names and this this new nigga this drew nigga yeah i'm on you too i'm on all you niggas Cause all this bitch ass shit going on in boxing, bro, it ain't right, it ain't real, it ain't facts, it's sucker shit. And I'm calling that shit out like I've been doing. And I've been cool, but I ain't being cool like that no more. You niggas is on some hoe shit. Wilder, you really on some hoe shit pushing this bitch ass narratives that you been pushing with the fact that this Tyson Fury shit when really, bro, you just got your ass whooped. And you need to accept the fact that you got your ass beat. Period. Fuck the LDBC and Deontay Wilder. Fuck you niggas. Because y'all all on some bitch bullshit. Y'all trying to, y'all basically fucking up the integrity of the sport of boxing. Y'all pretty much did it some way or another. Neither one of you hoe ass niggas can take losses. Y'all can't, y'all can't do shit productive and positive in the sport of boxing, bruh. Y'all niggas is hoes. Straight hoes. And I'm on your motherfucking necks. Fuck the LDBC, NBBC, NBBC forever, bruh. Boom gang, Reaper gang, honey.